Welcome to the show. I'm Kathy Ireland. With rolling blackouts, high energy costs, and limited access to electricity, there have been many attempts to solve the energy crisis. Water Rotor has created a unique solution using hydrokinetic systems that extract energy from slow moving waterways to bring clean electricity to at least 100 million people worldwide by 2030. Fred Ferguson, CEO, is back on our show today to update us on the latest developments on Water Rotor's unique and unprecedented solution. Welcome back, Fred. Yeah, no, great to be back talking with you again. Well, I agree. It's time. It's, it's been a year since we last spoke. And Fred, can you please tell us what's happening with Water Rotor? Well, as you may remember, we had created a uh, series of rotating, kind of a drum-like device that rolls with very, very slow moving water and extracts more than 50% of the energy. But what's happened, and the reason I'm back is, all of a sudden I started getting calls out of Florida asking whether we could extract the energy that flows within the Gulf Stream. And Water Rotor over the last eight years has been the only company that's actually been able to prove and extract energy from flows that are moving as slow as, even as slow as one mile per hour. But not only that, extracting more than 50% of that energy. How does the mega water rotor affect the ecosystem? And you're talking a, a massive size, right? Yes, it's, it's huge. Um, think of it like as if we were putting very large silo or tubular type devices underneath the surface perhaps 50 feet to a depth of as much as 500 feet, that that tubular rotating drum only moves at the speed of the water and the huge amount of torque that it generates can basically be taken to the surface and drive generators. So Fred, how is the project funded? Are you looking for investors? Yeah, so we're just finishing what I refer to as our first or A round. It's taken a lot of time and money. We've got about $25 million that's gone through the program, and now we have proof of technology. So the last, before we go into an exit or a partial exit, will be the last of $10 million, and we will basically move towards seeing this technology move into some very large manufacturing and power companies who will really take it forward. We brought it up to a stage where it's time for other people that know what they're doing to build and to use the power. Well, Fred, thank you so much for coming back to tell us about this incredible project and new era in renewable energy. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. And thank you for watching. I'm Kathy Ireland.